In their first meeting since the passing of former 2nd District Senator Jim Whaling, the Senate paid tribute to the longtime Atlantic County lawmaker. To recognize the impact that the three-term senator had on Atlantic City, the Senate approved two bills to honor his memory. The first one honors his life and service to New Jersey. The second one will name Atlantic City Boardwalk Hall after Whalen. Senator Colin Bell was also sworn in to represent Atlantic County. He is a former Atlantic County freeholder. Senate President Steve Sweeney joined his assembly colleagues and local leaders to call for the return of the $51 million trust fund to Salem County to help facilitate the sale of Salem Memorial Hospital and to support health care services in Salem County. The fund is needed to keep the hospital operating and to make sure that the vital health care for communities in the area is maintained. The Senate Legislative Oversight Committee, chaired by Senator Bob Gordon, met to discuss the staffing and funding crises at the State Board of Nursing. These shortages are responsible for crippling the Board's ability to process thousands of nursing license applications and investigate complaints. The Senate also marked Hispanic Heritage Month and paused to remember the devastation of Puerto Rico and the need for relief in the area following Hurricanes Maria and Irma. Thanks for watching. This has been the Senate Democrats, Week in 67.